Turbocharger never gets spoiled just like that. And in the next three minutes, we'll explain you how turbos go bad and what to do to never go bad. Let's go. So, as my father mentioned, turbo never spoil on its own. The turbo has two bearings and it, it does have a lifespan like the engine, but its lifespan is so, so much longer that to say that the turbo will spoil on its own is wrong. There's always some reason. Maybe it's servicing, maybe it's over revving, but there's always some reason. The turbo will never go bad on its own. Just remember that. Two, oil needs to reach the turbo. Every morning when you start your car, the oil gets moving around the car like the blood in your bloodstream. It's like, imagine that you have to wake up and first thing in the morning, you have to do some heavy, heavy bench press. You will not be able to do it. The same way your car, if the second you spark it, in some three seconds, you immediately want to move. And especially if you start moving fast, you will damage the turbocharger in no time. You need to give the turbo one or two minutes to get ready, wake up properly, let the oil reach the bearings and lube it up per se. Three, turbo needs to cool down. What does this mean? When you stop your driving, your turbo also needs to rest. Just like exactly when you're exercising after you finish, you also need to rest. So your turbocharger needs some two to three minutes because the hot side of the turbocharger gets very, very hot. Hot enough to actually burn the oil and make the turbocharger even seize up if it is hot enough. So give your turbo on idle some two to three minutes to cool down after intense driving. Also not so intense, but if you have driven some five kilometers at an average to high pace, still at least give the turbo one minute to rest. Four, oil is low viscosity. If the oil is too low in viscosity, the turbo bearings will go metal to metal. And what this will result in is metal particles and the bearings, they can seize up, the shaft can break. So many things can go wrong. So always remember, buy good quality oil and buy it from a reliable source so that there's no additives, nothing mixed in. So you never have to face this problem. All turbos will serve you forever as long as you do your maintenance on time. You buy all the requirements for maintenance at reliable places and you do it always properly by the book. If you do this, your turbo will survive longer than the engine itself. And most importantly, for more content like this, like, follow, and comment. Stay sharp.